Hey guys, welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how to use the tiling offset option for effect layers in Matrix 5. For this tutorial, we will work with the previous created Matrix patch, creating a 2D patch for DVI output with the patch editor. Now, let us have a look at the task. In the current patch, we will find two small DVI screens, one on the left and one on the right side. Furthermore, there is a larger DVI screen in the middle. On the two small screens, a SCE graph as a straight line from left to right in yellow should be displayed. And at the screen in the middle, a SCE color scroll from top to bottom with a color white of 75 should be displayed. Let us start. According to our task, we have to activate the SCE graph effect. Therefore, we navigate to the effect selection button and choose SCE graph. In the next step, we want to change the color to only yellow. Therefore, we click the colors button and now we want to remove all colors instead of yellow. If you want to select more than one color at the same time, please select the first of the desired colors, press and hold down the shift key of your keyboard and select the last desired color. All of the desired colors are now selected and we can click the minus button. Only yellow will be visible in the graph and we can close the color table. It is still a sine wave but a straight line is requested so we change the frequency to zero. Now one bar is running from top to the bottom and back again. We have to change the direction to bottom and it is running from left to right as required. In the next step, we want to change the mapping. Therefore, we open the map settings window again. In the map settings window, we change the position Y to only 5 and the size y to 16. Now we activate the tiling. We set the size x for tiling to only 8 and the offset to 25. In the last step we enable tile mode mirror H and you can see the effect is running mirrored as a bar from left to right. Why an offset of 25? It's because of the middle screen has a size of 25 and we want to have this space in between. The original effect is running on the left side in a size of 8 pixels according to the small DVI screen and then 25 pixel space and again an effect running mirrored horizontal with a size of 8 pixels in X. Let us close the map settings. We want to add a new effect layer, therefore we navigate to the layer button on the bottom left corner of deck A and performing a right click. Click new. This layer has no mapping of course, but we will map this later. First of all, we want to change the effect settings. According to the task, we have to select the SCE color scroll effect. The direction should be from top to bottom and a color white of 75. 
and the last step of the tutorial, we have to map this effect. We open the map setting window with a click at the map button and now we change the position x to 8 and the size x to 25. Now the color scroll effect is running on the screen in the middle and the two bars are running on the left and right DVI screens. That's it for now. Thank you for watching.